Hey guys, I'm back. I know it's been forever. It's actually been three weeks since I last filmed anything, to be honest. But uh, I've been working really hard. I've had a ton of photo shoots in Saudi Arabia. I'm back in New York. Look at that view. Look at that view. Now that's a view. Enjoy. So what has been going on with my life? I've had five photo shoots in four weeks in Saudi Arabia. I've been very busy. Uh, I've been pretty much like on my computer non-stop working and doing videos and editing the photos that I've been taking. So I've been like really busy with everything. Um, I kept forgetting to vlog while I was away. I'm back and I'm back with a vengeance. Uh, I'm a little upset that last time I vlogged my computer crashed and it ruined everything So at least now I have a new system and I'm getting used to it and hopefully everything will be so much better from now on Don't worry. I didn't forget you guys. It's just I've had so much on my plate. I didn't have time to do anything, but I'll make it back to you guys I promise. One thing I do want to do is I want to have a giveaway. When I hit 250 subscribers on YouTube, I'm going to be giving away one of those power banks. Uh, I have a few of them at home that I got as a present and yeah, I might as well share and care, you know? So where am I right now? I'm on Boulevard East in New Jersey, right across from the city. I've showed you guys this view before and uh, it's pretty cool. Um, I just recently moved out here it's pretty nice. Um, I'm still jet lagged, so I'm waking up really early in the morning before, as you guys can see, the streets are empty. But yeah, I like waking up this early and jogging. I love it. So far in my life, there's a lot of good things that have been going on. I'm very grateful and happy for that. And as Jay Z said, just push that dirt off your shoulder. Hell yeah. You guys are probably wondering why I have another suitcase behind me. I mean, I just got back from a trip. What am I doing packing up again? Well, I'm going on another trip, but this time I'm going down south to Georgia. I'm excited to go to Georgia. I've never been to the south. I mean, I've been to Florida once, but I was a kid. Doesn't count. This time I'm going to go nuts. Well, not really. I'm going to watch myself because I know how crazy I can get. And I'm definitely excited for the food. I hear the food is amazing. So yeah, am I excited for Georgia? Yes, I am. Uh, what do I plan on doing there? I have no idea. We're gonna find out. I'm exploring the south for the first time, so uh, that's what I'll be doing. And yes, this is how I pack my sneakers. is having a Santa convention. It's really funny because there's like 50 Santas downstairs in the lobby. I just went upstairs because we forgot something in the room. But I'll show you guys right now. Check this out. So this is probably the most boring Georgia um, vlog ever since I didn't really film in Georgia. Cause I'm a dumbass. Yup. All right, guys. I'm here in Atlanta at the World of Coke, and I'm gonna show you guys what's inside. Coca-Cola Noise of you are from Georgia. like two others. And that took place on May 8th of 1886. Always remember May 8th, that's Coca-Cola's birthday. Now back in the day, you'd get Coca-Cola syrup out of a syrup dispenser just like this one here. So right now we're heading towards the secret vault for Coca-Cola. And 
I'll show you guys something cool. Okay, right here we have the vault for Coca-Cola behind me. It's where they house the secret recipe for Coca-Cola and it looks pretty cool. It's a big vault. And we're not allowed to step behind this line. If we do, we're going to jail. <laughs> All right. So here at the World of Coke, we learned about the history of Coca-Cola, we saw the secret vault, we saw the bottling plant. Uh, it was really cool, it didn't cost that much to walk in, but we get a lot of free Coke. Now we're going to the tasting room and you guys check it out, it's really cool. Uh, there's over a hundred products, it's gonna be awesome. I'm gonna have a lot of sugar. <laughs> so I'm ready, I have my cup, and we're about to try the taste test. Starting off with Bebo, which is from South Africa. Mm. Tastes like pineapples. So now we're gonna try Sunfills from Mauritius. Mm. Very grapey. Another Bebo from South Africa, it's called DJ Kiwi Mango. So let's try this. I like this one a lot, it's a candy. We got Sunfill, I think it says menthol, and from Djibouti. <laughs> yeah, I said Djibouti. Let's try it. Mm. Tastes like toothpaste. Excellent for a date. You have this, you're good, you don't need to brush your teeth. I know some of y'all don't even brush your teeth. So we got Spear Latte from Zimbabwe. It's like weird strawberry that's watered down. I didn't like it. We got Bomb Bomb Angeles from Madagascar. Mm. Tastes like bubble gum. It's interesting. We got Stony Ginger Beer. Apparently this is really good from Tanzania. Very good. It's like a, a gingery, like Sprite. Wow, it really feels good with your throat. Our last one we're trying right here. We got Fanta Exotic from Uganda. Mm. It's pretty good so far in this selection. My two favorite have to be the Kiwi Mango and the Bon Bon. Madagascar in South Africa but the one that's coming in in a close third and that's just because it's excellent like for a date would you have to be the Sunfil Menthol from Djibouti seriously awesome 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 we're about to get Europe by storm so right now we're at Europe here are all the European countries that they have we have different things you have Spain Turkey Georgia Sweden Greece and Germany Germany and Italy so we're about to try this this is called uh, Aquarius the Great by in Spain Let's try this out. Oh wow. Wow. It tastes like lemonade. It's good. I like lemonade. So you got Fus tea in, in Turkey. I've tried this before, but I'll try it one more time. Lemon iced tea from Turkey, it's excellent. It's very smooth. It's not like the very sweet American iced tea. It's really good. See, this is another Fus iced tea. So this is from Georgia. This looks like it's uh, raspberries. Okay. Definitely very smooth. Um, has a bit of a taste to it. It's pretty cool. Now we have lingonberry. This is from Sweden. Mm. Mm. Not enough, no. 
Okay, I've had these. I've had this. This is excellent. Pineapple Fanta. Really good. This is from Greece. I've had it when I was in the UK. It's some good. It's really good. Very smooth. Not a big fan of it. Okay, so this is Bonaka. This is from Germany. It's apple juice, apple and pear. Mm. No, no, no. And then we have Mezzomix. This one's very well known in Germany, and all the Germans know this. Mezzomix is awesome. It's like the Fanta of Germany. Yeah, it literally tastes like an orange juice, no, an orange version of Coca-Cola. It's very nice. And then finally, we have Beverly from Italy. Apparently, it's really good. We're gonna try this out right now. No, no, no. I didn't like it at all. It tastes like bubblegum. But yeah. So that was Europe. Let's go to North America. So we're right now here at North America stuff. So. Uh, I've had the Powerade punch before and the vitamin water, so I'm not trying these out. I'm gonna try, and I've had the Pib and the Fanta Orange and the Fresca, so I'm only gonna have a few of these. We're gonna start out with the gold. This is tea, and it's sweet. It's very sweet. It's not like the Turkish tea that we had, the Turkish tea was a lot smoother. This is very sweet. Next, we're gonna have the Fanta Strawberry. I haven't tried it in the US yet. Oh my god, it's like candy. It's very good. But it's like candy. Okay, I'm very excited for this. They actually discontinued the surge for like 12 years. I had it when I was a kid and I haven't had it since. Let's try this. Oh, I'm excited for this. I'm like shaking. Just like I remember it. Oh my god. I'm gonna stay here forever. I'm done. You, you can go away. You just, just go away. Bye. Bye. Alright, so right now we have here the Asian section. I'm very excited for this because Japan has some really sick stuff. Okay, we're gonna try this. This is the veggie beta and it's from Japan. I'm actually worried. Uh, I don't know if it's gonna taste like salad or what's gonna taste like. It tastes nice. It tastes very fruity. It says vegetables. I thought it was going to taste like vegetables. You know, in Japan they make some crazy stuff. We got the, from Thailand, we got the melon broccoli from Fanta. Oh my god, it tastes like melon bubblegum. It's really good. Then we have, uh, what's it called? We have the crushed lemon from Bahrain. This is really cool. It tastes like an extra, it tastes like an extra lemony Sprite. It's really cool. The Minute Maid from Korea is called Joy Apple Liche. Liche or Lychee, Liche, whatever it is, it's gonna be good. It's very smooth, very, very smooth. Thumbs up from India. I have no idea what it tastes like. It probably tastes like a thumb, but we're gonna try it. It looks like a cola. No. No. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. No. Okay, we have China. Smart watermelon flavor. It's not just any watermelon. It's smart watermelon, okay? It makes y'all smart. Color of the watermelon. Finally, we have the apple kiwi from Thailand. Apple kiwi, let's go. It's okay, it could have been better. It tastes like apple fanta, honestly. All right, so now we're going to Latin America. Let's go. Alright, we're gonna be trying some cool ones right now. It's our last one we're trying. We got Venezuela right here. We got Honduras, Mexico, Brazil, Mexico, Costa Rica, Chile, and Peru. I hear this is amazing. I'm excited. Let's start off right here. We have Venezuela, we have Team Again, 
I'm sorry, I'm a little hyper. I've had so much to drink. Just like the rest of the teas, very smooth. I like it. Thumbs up. This is called Delaware Punch. But this from Honduras. Let's try this. Very smooth. It's like, well, uh, it's just like grape juice. Really good. We have Seal Aquarius from Mexico. Tastes like, tastes like uh, sweet tea, but more strawberry. We have Morana Quad from Brazil. Mm. Oh. So right here we have ginger ale from Mexico. Let's try ginger ale. Pretty good. It's not like other companies, but it's pretty good. Got Fanta from Costa Rica. This one's uh, Colita. I don't know what that is, but... Oh my god, it's like tasting bubble gum. Like actually, it's bubble gum. We have uh, Mazana Lift. And it's Roja. I don't think that's red in Spanish. You can correct me. Pretty smooth. I can drink this. And the one that I'm actually excited for Inca Cola. Inca Cola is gonna be awesome. Just like bubblegum, guys. Just like bubblegum. Well, that's it for the tasting. We'll see you later. Peace. All right, guys. So we've done our tour. We're about to leave. We need to grab one of these Coca Colas. They're complimentary. Only if you come here. So let's grab one. There we go. We're all the Coca Cola. See ya. Bye. Alright guys, so I'm at the airport right now in Atlanta and um, yeah, I have to now fly back to New York. <sighs> I'm gonna miss Atlanta, but I'm not gonna miss the amount of food I ate here and feeling like I had a heart, a heart, attack, a heart attack every single time I ate. <sighs> I'm tired. I want to go to bed. Seriously.